today we're going to be making a spooky plate for Halloween. I've got my slab, my templates, one for the outside and one for the inside, a rib, and my texture rollers. I'm going to spray the slab down and then smooth it with my rib. I use one of my texture rollers and roll a pattern on it that I want over most of the slab. Now I use my large template and a needle tool and cut out the outside edge of the plate. I take the smaller template, line it up on the inside, and lightly trace the outside edge with my needle tool. I smooth off the texture inside that edge, first with my finger, and then with a rib. I take a pre-made stencil I cut on my silhouette and line it up in the middle of the interior of the plate. I make sure to smooth over the edges of all the holes in the stencil so that a little bit of clay comes up between those holes. I want this so that the colored slip does not seep underneath the stencil. I then paint the stencil with colored slip. I want to make sure that I use several coats so that the image is even and opaque. I let this dry off before I take it off the stencil. Then I wait and let the slab get leather hard and place it on a big foam cushion. Now using that smaller template, I gently press into the slab and as I do so, I very carefully rock my hand around. If the sides get wobbly, I make sure to straighten them out. I flip the plate over to check on the edge and smooth any cracks that I find. And here is my finished plate.